Mr. Neeran here. So, it seems if we click on this button it will crash, but only if we record. If I don't record, then I won't have a crash. That's very weird. Let's click on the campaign. So I have a character here, Denarius Storm, clearly inspired by Denarius Stormborn from the Game of Thrones TV series. So we played with this character uh, a bit in uh, 2020, on February the 20th. Okay, and then I have some older saves from 2015. I had another, I believe an earlier save with the same character. She has a different armor, but it's the same character. And then in 2013, I had the same character. Uh, I played the game on May 1st, 2013. Okay. We kind of want a new character. Go for a female. I usually play females. Okay, let's hope it won't uh, won't uh, crash when we click there. Can change stuff. Yeah, it worked good. So this clearly looks like. <coughs> Something, uh, I believe, like a dark elf or something <coughs> from Warhammer. So I used this before, I believe. One of them, one of the two uh, blonde hair variations. <coughs> so you need to go back. This game is clearly older, so the, there are no moving mouths when they speak, and yeah, it's kind of outdated when it comes to the graphics. Kind of like this head, and this one. I think we'll go for the, with this because I played a character that looked almost like this one when I did my prologue before. I think we will redo the prologue. Okay, abilities, light combat arts, heavy combat arts, ranged combat, white magic, eternal magic, mind magic, and black magic. So light combat arts means... Uh, <coughs> light combat arts deal with light, quick weapons and armor that allows for freedom of movement. To attain higher levels, good dexterity and agility are required. So this is like uh, assassin, rogue type. Okay, heavy combat arms. <coughs> heavy combat art is the ability to master large and powerful weapons and wear heavy armor and shields. To attain higher levels, very high levels of strength and stamina are required. <coughs> I like warrior types or knight types, so we'll probably go for it. <coughs> we also have, uh, ah, we get different weapons when we click on this. Rain combat gave us a bow or an, a crossbow, I'm not sure. Ranged combat <coughs> allows for mastery of bows and crossbows. To reach higher levels, a high level of dexterity and solid strength are required. White magic gives us a robe. <coughs> White magic is used to sustain strength. Higher levels can be re reached by very high levels of wisdom and a good amount of intelligence. Elemental magic. <coughs> Elemental magic is dedicated to controlling the elements, fire, ice and earth. High intelligence and wisdom are required to reach higher levels. So that's the typical sorceress or row, uh, or uh, sorcerer. Uh, white magic seems to be more of a buff type, like a priest. Maybe can heal uh, other characters and uh, increase their strength and such. 
mind magic <clears throat> mind magic is used to influence the spirit either positively or negatively to reach higher level higher skill levels very high charisma and relatively high intelligence are required uh, or requisite okay black magic <coughs> black magic is used to destroy and weaken to reach higher levels very high level of intelligence and a relat uh, relatively high level of wisdom are required we'll go for heavy combat arts i like that uh, the name so this looks like a high elf Either we play that one or this one. Hmm. Actually, we might go for this one. Okay. Elder it. Okay. Like my dark elf. Okay. Um. She looks like this, otherwise she will uh, look like this. I kind of prefer this. I believe we have the mod on that turns the elves into, uh, I believe, frost elves or something. I'm not sure. We will see. Might need to turn them back. This is more of a trial. Ah, so I have remaining points 30 and specialization, large blade weapons. So, heavy combat arts, large blade weapons. This ability allows the use of large bladed weapons which have the highest damage value, such as a large one and two handed swords and axes. Large blunt weapons. Ah, the weapon will change swords. Blunt weapons like uh, clubs. Uh, the ability permits the use of blunt weapons with the highest possible destructive power. <coughs> the weapons include one and two handed hammers, clubs, and staves. We don't want that. The first one was this ability allows the use of large bladed weapons which have the highest damage values, such as large one and two handed swords and axes. I like that, but heavy armor. This ability enables the wearing of the heaviest and most durable armor. I also like that, but I don't like that she got the worst weapon. Okay, then we have shields. Um, this ability allows the use of the best shields and thus the best possible protection from melee and ranged attacks. Okay. These are um, large bladed weapons. Highest damage point. Large one and two hundred swords and axes. Heavy armor. Best shields. We can't have all of it. Okay. I think we will go for the blades. Okay, stats. Remaining points 30. We will. Um, Strength and stamina. Okay, it done. all began with the discovery of the old fire and the secret of the convocation. Thirteen mages blinded. Driven by the greed for divine power. And under the bondage of the circle, their armies unleashed death and destruction. Bonded with the power of ancient runes. Cursed to eternal life and eternal death. until the last day of the old era had dawned.
come to witness the day of my ultimate triumph? Poor old man. No. To witness your downfall. <laughs> you cannot win. The Convocation is a lie. It will destroy all of us. So... Tahira! Rune sent us. He needs the power of the Rune Warriors. The Northern Realms are in danger. Rowan knows I will never serve a Circle Mage again. My powers are exhausted. I have seen quite enough misery and bloodshed. Rowan will have to look for somebody else. That's why he sent us. A very special rune lies concealed somewhere in these lands. We here to search for it. But we were attacked and Lev is wounded. He needs your help. We need your help. Then I hardly have any choice. Very well. I will help you. Where is Lev? I lost sight of him somewhere behind the gate there. I hope he's still alive. These damned orcs. I'll look for him. You stay here by my hut. Thank you, Tahira. It's good to have you back with us. Alright, we are controlling Tahira. Welcome to the world of Spell Force. In this prologue, we will explain the game to you. Let's start with some general information. The name of the main character in the prologue is Tahira. She is a combination of fighter and sorceress. From now on, we will refer to the main character as the Avatar. Once you've solved the prologue, the game will continue with the Avatar you selected before starting the game. All right. 
right. Whenever you hold the mouse pointer over a button or an object, a help window with additional information will appear in the bottom left corner of the screen. When you are asked to click on something, this means a click with the left mouse button. We'll tell you about the right mouse button a little later in this presentation. When you click the Options button in the upper right, you can save the game or change the game settings at any point in time. Now select your avatar by clicking on Tahira in the game world. Very good. You can move the view with either the cursor keys or with the mouse by holding down the right mouse button. You can also adjust the view by moving the mouse pointer to the appropriate edge of the screen. A selected unit is marked with a colored ring. Your own units have a green ring. Enemy units a red and neutral or allied units a blue ring. In the lower left, you can see the currently selected units and some additional information such as name, health condition, and amount of mana. You can select your avatar at any time by clicking on the portrait button in the upper left corner of the screen. By clicking on the portrait button with the right mouse button, the view will be moved to the appropriate unit. Move to here or down the path to the east and through the open stone gate to the bindstone, a large boulder, by clicking the right mouse button next to it. Bindstones. As soon as you have activated this function, a menu with your active bindstones appears. Select the destination of your choice and click on OK to travel to that spot. Okay. So you can play like this, like an ordinary RTS, and just move her around. It's for the troops usually. But you can also move into this view. Unfortunately, she is, um, let's see, cancel, menu, options, let's see if I can find any controls, out the north of RMB scroll on, deactivate the scroll function of your right mouse. Activate border scrolling. The visible section of the screen will then automatically be moved when the mouse cursor is moved to the edge of the screen. Inverted mouse lock. Inverted vertical camera movements with the mouse. I'm not sure what that does. Inverted mouse lock. Um, hit information, external tips, inverted zoom key, reverts the function of the key for camera zoom. Let's see. Yeah, it just made it the opposite. I see. Cancel. Options I prefer the other. Problem is I can't uh, uh, see her from. Uh, I can't move around the camera. She moves when I move. Okay. Some games you can actually view the camera so you can see her from the front. Okay. Um. I kind of prefer to play in the RPG view. Some animal here. The Bindstone offers the Avatar an opportunity to connect his room with this place. Should he perish, he will appear in the last Bindstone used. 
Enemies are able to sever the connection to a bind stone if they attack it, thus causing you to lose one active bind stone. All right. Select the bind stone with a click. At the bottom edge of the screen, you will find the action bar. A new symbol for activate this bind stone should have appeared there. Click on that symbol. The bind stone will light up and is now active. You are now bound to this bind stone. All right. In the lower right, you will find the overview map. Black areas have not yet been explored and are automatically uncovered when you approach them with units. Your avatar has a greater view radius, so he will uncover a larger area. The dots All on right. the overview map are in different colors. Green dots represent your own units, red enemy and blue neutral or allied units or buildings. A few special objects such as monuments are marked in yellow. Okay. Continue along the path to the east. A deer here. Yeah. Spell Force offers you the option of witnessing the events of the game from different views, including the third person perspective, where you see the action from a position directly behind and slightly above your avatar. To change the view, press the page up key to zoom in and the page down key to zoom out, or simply turn the mouse wheel. By moving the mouse wheel downwards or pressing page down, the camera will zoom out into an almost vertical perspective. Now, when you move the mouse wheel upwards or press page up, you will see the normal isometric views from different distances. Now change to the third person perspective by zooming in closer. This is only possible if your avatar is inside the field of view. In the third person perspective, you can control your avatar directly with the cursor keys or with the a, D, S, and W keys. If you hold down the right mouse button, you can change the view direction. Otherwise, operating spell force in this perspective is identical with the isometric view. Follow the path in third person perspective toward the east to the next stone gate. You can change to the third-person perspective any time during the game, but for now, we will assume you will be using the isometric view. All right, I think. Change back to the normal isometric view with the mouse wheel. An enemy goblin is lurking around the next corner. He isn't very dangerous. When you hold the mouse pointer over him, a bar will show you his health condition. Ah, oh, that's the goblin. Select your avatar and click with the right mouse button on the goblin. Your avatar will attack the goblin. As soon as he has been defeated, we will continue. from a right to a virtual address for which it does not have the appropriate access. Uh, seems I can't use the NVIDIA Shadow Play Recorder when playing this game. Very annoying. When I recorded it in the past, I believe I used the Bandicam Recorder. I could try that instead, okay. 
spell for the order of dawn so you will restart the game and restart the, the remake the character so I had an older character that I had played about five or so uh, maps already with I believe I was at level 21 or something we will use the same um, we will be um, a warrior or knight so you will have the heavy combat arts and uh, <coughs> heavy combat arts uh, is the ability to master large and powerful weapons and wear heavy armor and shields to attain higher levels, very high levels of strength and stamina is required or are required ok so we will go for the heavy combat arts we will have the large blade weapons this ability allows the use of large bladed weapons which have the highest damage values such as large one and two handed swords and axes we will have 15 in strength and 15 in stamina the reason I am restarting is because I uh, didn't play much in forever so uh, I believe I played some in, in, in 2013 and then I played a lot in 2015 and then some in 2020 but I didn't record I had an older let's play of all the uh, prologue uh, episodes so we won't do the prologue I have that uploaded on YouTube already in much worse quality by the way because I used the original resolution of the game and I recorded that and I also had like the old school uh, screen resolution so it was like on an old computer screen uh, but uh, now I'm using a mod which in a, uh, enhances the resolution of the game the graphics the textures etc okay so we will be, be named Lynette Fredo uh, Stalker In a Shadows, okay, yeah. whatever uh, Okay, so I went for this phase because I used that in the past I just want to replay whatever I had played before Let's start the game It all began with the discovery yeah intro video I recorded that previously so I have updated my graphics card by the way uh, the graphic uh, drivers welcome yeah. back my friend I know your memory is paled eight years is a long time many things have happened the war is over but its consequences were terrible the convocation has shattered the countenance of our world since then, I've tried to retain whatever is left over from this world. But now I have a feeling of time closing in. The circle is closing, and these lands need a protector. May the power of the ruin reawaken with you. But this time, you should not be the slave of someone else's will. This rune is the scourge on which your soul was forged. Wear it now yourself and be the master of your own decisions. I... I'm free. Master Rowan, the Order sent me with an important message. Something's happening at the Wildland Pass. Creatures made of black steel. They are breaking into the Northlands. The Iron Ones have come. So, it has now begun. You must set out at once. Indeed. I will go see Darius. You, my friend, should gather your strength first and arm yourself. Follow the messenger to the town of Greyfell. When you get there, speak to my friend Sartarius. He will give you your instructions. He belongs to the Order of Dawn. Good luck. We'll meet again when I return, Rune Warrior. By the gods! He really called a Rune Warrior! I... I can hardly remember. How do I get to that city? Greyfell. Follow the path through the rocks. I'll go with you. But let's be careful. The mountain goblins are in an uproar. Alright. So, uh, <clears throat> that guy, Rowan, was probably the mage from the intro video. Here we have a companion, a messenger. 
we can either play like this where we can select the character and move around like this or we can and we can also zoom in like in this and still play like a traditional strategy game he will follow us I think he is not uh, controllable by the player okay yeah, so we can play like this I, I prefer playing like an RPG forgot to check uh, if there are any new mods for this game Anyway, let's play the first part of the game while we are recording. Then we can check for mods and such. Oh, he's in a fight. Yeah! He's here! Forest beetle that we will take care of. <laughs> Alright, inventor by the way, so we started at uh, level 1 of course. We earned some experience. Armor class 25, life 43 out of 43, mana 25 out of 25. We only have the heavy combat arch, large blade weapons, we had come pretty far with the other character. She had a lot of abilities and skills, I have forgotten about it. Okay, so we have some gear. She looks like this uh, um, when uh, she doesn't have her gear. Skill, I see. We have War Cry. Let's move it over here. This is a magic scroll. Describe this spell into your spellbook. Drop the scroll into an empty space. The scroll's contents will be absorbed and the spell entered into your book permanently. Mana usage 25. The cost time 120 seconds. Range uh, 0.45. Caster and up to 10 allied units will cause higher damage with melee weapons for a short time. Okay, so we've added it there, which uh, it makes it show up here, so now we can use it on the number one button, I believe. Uh, we also have the human worker level one. Use this worker rune uh, on a monument of the respective race to summon workers. So we, there are two, evil, two factions in this game. There are good uh, and evil, of course. And on the good side we have humans, we have dwarves, and we have elves. And on the <laughs> evil side we have orcs, we have dark elves, and we have uh, blue chaos, but I'm not sure. Then there are some minor races like undead, etc. I believe uh, that there are mods that make uh, it possible to play as the minor races. <coughs> so the elves have uh, are usually forest uh, wood elves, but uh, there is a mod uh, that I have downloaded uh, a few years back that uh, makes me uh, that enables me to replace the wood elves with the skins of the f frost elves or whatever ice elves, and, and uh, then they will look like the ice elves of the game instead. Otherwise, I believe the ice ones are enemies uh, of a certain campaign. So we are playing the Order of Dawn original campaign now, but I believe there are two more uh, after. One is... Uh, uh, we will see. Uh, I don't remember exactly what they were named, but... I believe the Ice Elves or Frost Elves, they are enemies, but you can play as them by replacing the, the original Elves uh, using a mod. Okay, then there are uh, mods en enabling you to play as Undead and as... Uh, Beastman too. Okay, maybe I don't know exactly which faction this is, but uh, they are these three are 
good and these three are evil and uh, we play as a uh, good uh, faction we can have all three good uh, races but we need to find monuments with all of them and we only have a a uh, rune of humans currently uh, so I believe we will have humans in the beginning and then get elves and then dwarves then later we can probably have the evil races too okay but uh, for now we are the good uh, faction <coughs> I don't know if we are good the entire campaign I prefer kind of the, the dark elves but in this mo uh, game actually I prefer the, the good because I like the wood elves more than the dark elves they look better um, they have better looking females uh, but anyway let's check the this is the plans menu so we have some buildings here we have woodcutter's hut um, wood 40 is the cost the, this building can be constructed in the game as long as there are enough resources available yeah that's the same for ev every one of them doesn't tell us what it does okay then we can uh, recruit some units um, yeah okay and uh, currently do not have the others so these are trolls orcs trolls and dark elves okay and there are map mods that enables us to place the undead a minor faction in the game and the chaos uh, or the demon minor faction uh, but I don't think you can play as them and the old ones I believe they replace the, the, the older ones and if you want to play the story as it's intended it's better to play the original races okay then there are a free mode where you can play with your leveled up characters in in uh, free missions with co uh, and cooperate with friends over LAN or the internet internet no longer works because this is the CD version of the game I don't know if there are uh, or is a more <coughs> modern version of the game where you can play over, over steam or something but in this version you used to use the um, game spy way of playing online and game spy went bankrupt and since then you can't use it um, but maybe you can play LAN online using game ranger and, and such okay we have a mission main quest to Greyfell, follow the path through the mountains. So that's the first quest. Oh, we have a box here, we will take it. Okay, inventory. Level 3. Can't uh, use it then, I think. I can try. I could use it. Let's see the stat differences. Armor class 12, armor class 16, this one is certainly better. Armor class 3, you do not, do not have any helmets, so you have to use that. You do not have any hero either, currently. We took all the stuff from that box. Now our hero looks like this. So we have a minimap in the lower right corner it can help us navigate the world. Let's move up here. We have a monument here, a bindstone. We might be able to get heroes there. So this game is pretty beautiful. Then we have the enhanced textures, but yeah, it looks kind of outdated. Let's click on the bind stone. And you activate this blind stone. The soul of your avatar is bound to this location in case your avatar dies. Okay, it was already activated. We started here. We need to go down. Couldn't jump down, we need to follow the road. This guy will follow us, but he is not a real companion because you are supposed to be able to control real companions. So he's probably just a temporary uh, ally. Follow the road through the mountain, like the quest said. I 
like the sound and music and such and, and the graphics look good but uh, yeah the, the world itself is outdated as you can see only slightly better than old games and if we didn't have the enhanced graphics it would probably look something like World of 3 okay um, it's from 2003 so, uh, or 23 so it's uh, as old as World of 3 okay let's iron is light to this welcome to the northern realms what kind of place is this here? This is the Shadow Pass. It leads through the mountains to our capital city, Greyfell, the seat of the House of Wolfgar. Alright, so if you click on one, we'll pick this option. How do I get to Greyfell? How do I get to Greyfell? Just follow this trail. You can't miss it. But keep your eyes peeled. This land isn't called the Shadow Pass for nothing. Should you get into trouble, then run back here. We will know how to defend your life. Alright. That's fine. Let's speak to this guy if we can. We couldn't speak to him. He's just this. So, a <laughs> god. Okay. An enemy over there. Let's attack. With me, men. So I had a problem with the game where the mouse would uh, blinker or such stutter and, and uh, the game would uh, lag, but after I so updated the gra drivers of the NVIDIA graphics card with the latest ones from July 2021 uh, it uh, sold itself, I hope it won't return buy this game back in the day was that I, I believe I bought Spellforce 2 first and the reason I bought it was because I read on the cover and I liked the idea of combining a strategy game with a role playing game. I played a lot of role playing games back in my teenager years and I played a lot of strategy games back when I was like a kid so uh, I played like Age of Empires, Warcraft 3 and Battle for Middle Earth then I also played the games like Final Fantasy VII, uh, World of Warcraft, and, uh, and a bunch of other stuff. So I, I like the idea of combining the strategy games with the role-playing games, which uh, Spellforce 2 did. And then I like the graphics of, I believe the graphics of the characters. <laughs> The overall graphics uh, are of course better in uh, the graphics uh, are better in uh, Spellforce 2, but I like the architecture better better in this game, so that's why I bought Spellforce 1. We're under attack. <laughs> Spellforce 2. 
Has the old man gone off? As you predicted, my lord. He will move on to the wild and pass. Good. The snare is slowly beginning to close. He will never return from there. What will happen with the rune slave, my lord? Kill him. And then give this casket to the leaders of the Black Fist. It contains the plans for the invasion. But my lord, I cannot conquer this rune warrior. I I'm just a messenger, not a fighter. I have complete confidence in you. Bring the casket to the Black Fist. I will give you a princely reward. <laughs> Lord. All right then. Die, rune slave. <laughs> My mind must be. All right, we won the fight. We got the box, a magically sealed casket. Let's check it out. Ah, uh, new video. What happened here? Treason. I must get to Greyfell by the fastest route. Mountain goblins have blocked that route. They're already setting up a camp. There is a rune monument right near. Summon your army there. It's the only way you can break through to Greyfell. First I must search for this traitor. The casket must be brought to the Order as quickly as possible. All right. Seven mission to bring this casket to, to the order. I need to take the loot from this chest too. Okay, inventory. So we have a sword, level 1, 2 to 4. Okay, the one we have is better. Can't carry the other stuff, okay. Mission. Battle against the mountain goblins, claim the monument. Sure. So we killed our companion, he was evil, I had forgotten about that. When I played this game previously, I believe I didn't have the enhanced graphics too. This is the first time I played with the better graphics. I believe after I installed them, like in 2020, I believe uh, I played some uh, uh, like uh, free battles or whatever. Oh, we have a monument here, a human monument, that's good. Uh, we need to bind it first. So we'll go to this bind stone. Now we can construct stuff. Activate this monument upon which you may call for units of thi at this monument. <laughs> so we can go for human workers. 20. Okay, so the 
first thing you will do my is way. hunt some animals. At your service. Yeah, they're food. Understood. No problem. Oh, I see. They need a specific building to do that. Breaks over. Time for work. We can ready to go. Cut down some some trees. As you have done. Your orders. We'll order five Out to of work. them to Here I am. Down trees. As good as done. That's four. We need Master of the more. rune. I'm on it. Master of the rune. Other resources we can use here. We have stones over here. Let's uh, order five Master more the to go there. At your service. Ready to go. Here I am. Okay, so five of our workers are cutting down trees, and five will be mining stones. Leave these are stones. We have other resources iron here. We will order five more to go there. Your orders? Yes. At your service. Okay. Here I am. Maybe it's enough for three. Okay, we have three more. No, actually, we had more. Ready to go. That. At your service. All right then. So here, here I here. am. Then we can order the final fifth one to go here too. Here so, the workers are being put to work here. your service uh, some work. so we have woodcutter's hut up to five workers but can be assigned here of course we want the woodcutter's hut work. there all of here them help with I'm that on it. then it will be constructed faster if there are more working on it we don't want them to actually your orders? start getting trees when it's finished Building completed. On my way. All right then. Master of the Stop room. There. You don't want Ready to, to go. That. All right then. Okay. And uh, quarry assigned with up to five workers. Be up gathering of stone. Of course, we want that too. Save we yourself. The lines must hold. <laughs> They will occasionally attack them. So you will need to kill them a little now and then. A little bit now and then. Okay, so we have um, stone no fixed. Here I am. We don't Understood. Need, we don't need that many to work with stones. Here I am. Here we have uh, my iron. Of course, we want that too. Let's but get not cracking then. Those three goblins. We we'll place it over here. Yeah, I like the buildings of this game better than the Spellforce 2 game because they made them smaller, and I prefer when they are big. Looks more immersive and more realistic. Let's kill this goblin. Building completed. Yes, 
On my way. Oh, I see Master of the rune. Them to, to do that. I'm on it. No problem. Okay. Um. Hunting lodge. Leave three of them. Can Your work. Orders? Hunting lodge. So they can start killing animals and get food. I'm on food. it. We will order them to do that. Yes. And. Uh, crossbow tower. Could use a crossbow tower over here. Off to work. <laughs> yeah, I like that the buildings are big in this game. I used to wish they were in, in Spellforce 2 because the graphics there are even better. <coughs> but it's kind of meh and the buildings are too small. Building completed. Doesn't feel as real. Now they should start hunting animals. Cross their crossbows. Yeah, kill that deer. Starting to gather food from it, just like in Age of Empires. We're building a tower here to protect against marauding goblins because they will come. Then it's annoying to have to handle them every time. We are building up the tower here. It's still pretty cool that they made a game like this. Yeah, I was a big fan of, of, of this uh, combining of strategy games and uh, role, role playing games. But I never actually finished the game. Played some of Battle Force 2 and then some of this game, but never really played more than the. I believe I played a few maps a few years ago, but I had forgotten about it. I want to play the entire story of this game, then go on to Battle Force 2. So Battle Force 2 is named, uh, I believe, Shadow Wars. Battle Force 2 Shadow Wars. Here they come. Goblins. You really need it there. Here I am. Okay. We're under attack. Here. Ah. Here. Defend the settlement. Yes. On my way. Ambush. No problem. It's an ambush. Okay. Small headquarters. Allows upgrading of the worker and combat unit limit. Okay, no, I need the forge. So you can build military units. Off to work. I need a new worker, he killed one. Yes. Off to work. He uh, he should repair it. Destroy building. Use this button to select the great monument. Okay, scouts recruit. Let's go for a recruit and a scout. I believe uh, one of them is range and the other is.
Right, right away, sir. sir. You also have uh, ready for action. Some uh, formations. I believe in the second game you can even order them to patrol and such, but not. This. Moving out. Let's move them right away, power. sir. Crossbowmen, swordsmen, basic troops. Of course, with a Mercy mod, it level 2. Um, it does this uh, strategy game and role playing game much better in terms of um, third person and having a huge army. This game is a real RPG, so. <laughs> your orders on my way All right. yes this guy can construct another building Guys are taller than my hero. Yeah. Okay. Yes, sir. Uh, one of the recruits and uh, awaiting your orders. No, Ready to fight, sir. Button there. Awaiting your orders. Ready for action. Eyes open, sword ready, okay, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Those two. We'll have to Moving out. Defend. Right away, sir. The others. Yes. Be my group. Destiny awaits. Okay, we have nine units selected. Yes, sir. Understood. Okay. Inventory request. Up a camp, destroy the goblin camp. Okay, we should destroy a camp of goblins. Fine, Let's do that. Forwards. So we can order the army to move as we move forward. Quickly now. I like that there are a lot of uh, animals. Makes the world come alive. <laughs> 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 Okay. Get some hands. Armor class ten. Yeah, we have better, so we don't need that. Here we have a chest. We'll go there. 
Understood. Moving out. On my way. Cool. Something happened. Cave. An old, weather beaten cave, which seemingly used to be a tomb. A distance whispering can be heard. Perhaps it's the wind. Right away, sir. Okay, move Moving here. out. In inventory. We need to check whatever we got. We are level 2 now, by the way. So we can increase some points. Let's see here. New ability. Light combat arts would be good. Let's train the ability. And... Uh, Piercing weapons, light blade weapons. Oh, I forgot. Piercing weapons. This ability allows the use of daggers, the quickest close combat weapon, as well as other trusting weapons. These are particularly suited uh, dexterous fighters of do skill in magic. Okay. Light armor would be good, or... Maybe light blade weapons, but I think light armor is trained the ability. Okay. Can also increase our strength. Let's see here. Light combat has to be. We don't have any ability points left at the moment. Increasing a level will give you additional ability points. The ability permits the bearing of special armor well suited for de dexterous and agile fighters. Okay, let's increase our strength. Okay, we're done there. We have two skills here, Berserk and Warcry. Let's add Berserk now. So... Uh, yeah. For a short time, casting unit causes very high damage with melee weapons. Okay. We have a quest item, Mist Crystal. This item does not belong to any of uh, the other categories. It may, however, be useful for quest or be of interest to a trader. Okay. Oh, well, let's just I emptied it. Didn't Understood. Oh, don't All right. Here. Right away, sir. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
building there. Kill that goblin. Moving out. Right away, sir. Moving out. They're attacking. <laughs> Destroy the buildings. Yes, sir. All right, another recruit. Let's move it All back right. there. Summon some workers. We can have more workers now. At your service. Woodcutter. Here we go. Lodge. Let's send yes. two more to the hunting lodge. Breaks over. Time for work. Master of the rune. Okay. I'm on it. Master of the rune? Let's get cracking then. Yes? All right, breaks then. over. Time for work. that guy ah this music it's from this game I didn't know that I've heard it in other games some uh, medieval 2 mods have it that's nice I'm 
gonna check some modding sites if there are any new mods for this game. Could be cool. Ah, there we have some bandits. <coughs> 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 I am. Your orders? Yes. Okay. More of these bits. Here we go. Ready to go. Let's get cracking then. Securing the area. We want some of them to join us. Ah, oh, they have a damage guy. Wonder if there is a fountain or something that can heal us. Yes, sir. Sir. Yes, sir. Understood. All the recruits will be moved over Ready there. to fight, sir. Eyes open, sword ready, sir. On my way. All of them. Awaiting your orders. Back, one Understood. Guy, one recruit guy and one scout will be moved back. Ready for action. Right away, sir. Ready for action. Here's the damage guy. Sir. Yes, sir. This sir. Guy, he yes, sir. Hold back. Right away, sir.
Yes. Okay. Yes. That wasn't intended. Now we have 18. That's good. So our miss increased. So almost uh, uh, empty the iron resources there. here anymore. Still have stones to, to mine. Okay. I do not have any here animals I am. then uh, stop on my way. Yeah, cutting down trees instead. At your service. Right then. Or to mine some stones. They need to cut down Very well, off too. I go. Your orders? Master of the rune? I'm on it. Oh, yes, breaks so over. Please. Time for work. Master of the rune? Understood. Ready to go. Ah, uh, they can't. At your service. Then let's go over some that trees. way. Trees over there. Yes. At your service. At your service. You don't want them to just stand there. Let's speak to this guy. Maybe he has something to say. Very well, off I go. No, On my way. Let's get cracking then. Spill a tower over there. Master of the rune? And another tower could be built here. Ready to go. Here I am. As good as done. Your orders? On it. Sir, 
Yes, sir. Okay, Moving out. The troops. I think they have the tower. What happened to the guy that was damaged? Yes, it's sir. Tea. Securing the area. All right. Longer here because we had only two workers working at that uh, with that hour. Sent Master of the room? Handle, handle the house here. Ready to go. Breaks over, time for work. Of the Understood. Room. Let's get cracking then. At your service. As good as done. Master of the rune? More houses. Off to work. Yeah, it looks very nice. your service. All right, we need uh, more houses. Not in the middle of the road. As good as done. Goblin yes. attacks have stopped, so we kill the goblins that were terrorizing us. That's good. Breaks over, time for work. On it, master of the rune. Let's get cracking then. Your orders. 
here we go. Okay, lots of houses. So it will become a real pace. This one. That's the human monument. completed All right Master of the room more Building completed Let's build building completed then. Ready to go. As good as done. Master of the room. Here we go. Ready to go. At your service. Your orders. Master of the room. Okay, these guys can go. Back On my to way. Over, yeah. time for work. Building completed. Building completed. Ready to go. At your service. command here I am on my way your orders all right let's build that house building completed your service your orders building completed your orders all right uh, see if you can build some more can build on there all right off to work there Yes. Cut down this tree, maybe we can build there too. I'm on it. Here we go. Break's over, time for work. I am. Can't build anymore here. Don't want to build in the middle of the road either. Let's build the house of a deer. Here I am. Go and check. 
check out the towers. Check our town from this view. This is our town. There's the other towers over there. Ready to go. Here. It's in the middle of the road, but I'm it's on not it. There. Now we are beyond the towers. Down here. Seems to be a road down there too. So if we follow this road. See that it leads to a bridge. So we are going. I believe the mission said we should go east. So we are going the wrong way now. Ah, Wolfgard Town Guard. I believe here is where we came from previously, I think. Yeah, this guy we spoke to him. Let's go back. Build your orders, more houses, maybe. Let's build another house over there. Okay, good job. Ready to go. Workers, let's build some more houses. As good as done. See that we have the rest of our workers. Master of the rune? We can use more than one worker. Yes. Okay. Awaiting your orders. On my way. Pull him away as we select At your service. Here. Another house.
at your service. Ready to fight, sir. Right away, sir. Moving out. This guy could move to the On my way. Yes. Yes? Building completed! Building completed! Here I am! Yes. Building completed. Ready to go. All right. Uh, let's see if we have any more slots. I don't think so. Here I am. Side, yeah. Yes. There we have the town. Now we have homes all the way to the bridge. Oh, here we have some workers. Yes. Ready to go. See if we can build anything more. Here we start. Let's build up a structure there too. Your orders?
I can't build any more here. Can't build in that area. Alright, we're done. Let's go and check all the areas we have built in. Or built on. Here we had some allied towers protecting this area. As you can see our worker over there, the starting location. Right away, sir. Order our troops to come here. cool that we can construct buildings almost everywhere. If we move to the side if the building is directly in front of us. Here comes the troops. Right away, sir! Formations Circle, semicircle and double row. Double row formation, all select the US line up to form two rows. Semicircle formation. Melee fighters organize themselves in a protective semicircle around the strongest selected unit. Circle formation. Melee fighters form a protective circle around the strongest unit in the selection. Okay, let's go for the two rows. This is information. The only thing missing is the patrol ability. Infantry. I mean, inventory. Okay, um, mission continue east. Ready for action! On my way! See if we can actually enter the tower or not. Alright! No, we couldn't. Understood! So the new troops will go here automatically. Okay, let's click on the hero. Select all the army. Alright. Right away, sir. Alright, you can move towards the other side. On my way. That area.
this army is uh, used to basic troops. Reserves and 547 in wood reserves. to fight sir sir yes sir moving out Let's right away sir army down there eyes open sword ready sir. the area yes okay so our army is now consisting of 26 men now look at the city the whole buildings it looks much better when the buildings are big instead of small looks kind of amazing for such an old game quickly now Ah, goblin there. Let's kill it. On my way. So let's just follow the road. See some enemies over there. Cave orc. So we'll attack the orcs. Right away, sir. First. 
Yes, sir. Moving out. Oh, a cinematic. Orcs, they're burning everything down. Where are the guards? Help us in our defense, quick! Otherwise, we are lost. All right, we will help you. Tag soldiers. Save the Understood. All right, soldiers. Move right here. away, sir. And line up. Thank you. Without you, things would have looked pretty bleak for us. The guards have a good drubbing to look forward to, those nincompoops. Here, take this as your reward. And please excuse the others. The people are a little frightened of you. You're a rune warrior, aren't you? On the way to Greyfell. Oh, it isn't very far from here to Greyfell. Just follow the trail up the mountain. Have a good journey. All right.
Alright, we're down here. Good job, soldiers. Did a jo good job there, winning the battle. Let's move forward. Understood. Stop moving information. Moving out! Run. We have a city over there. An allied city, I'm pretty sure. Understood! Right away, sir! Moving out! Right away, sir! On my way! Securing the area! Understood! All right! Moving out! Send up our troops first. We have enemies over there. Move back, soldiers. Right away, sir! Need to kill these guys. Securing the area! Some orcs over here. Understood. Moving out. First, we have no enemies in sight. This map is pretty big. First real map. 
Come on, soldiers, hurry up. We don't have a way. There are two entrances into this city. Huge city with walls. On my way! down on the area. That's the village that we saved. Came from there. I don't think we checked this building. Alright, let's move into the city. It's guarded. Wolf guard veteran. All right. They seem strong. Our scouts and recruits wouldn't be able to handle them. We have civilians too. I like that. There are civilians in the towns. Can I speak to them? No, not this one at least. We can only speak to some of them. Give him a merchant, I believe. Merchant, let him. Okay. Maybe we should save the, the gear for now. Might need it. Merchant armor. How much coal do we have? So we have no zero. Eleven of the worst copper. Okay. Okay. There are more merchants. Lots of merchants in the towns. Sell different things. Sell different. Classes, I believe. It's a very populated city. You have another type of troop, Dawn Knights. Einstein. Sartarius? That's who I am. And you must be the rune warrior Rowan awoke. Rowan is in great danger. I must speak to him. He set out toward the Wildland Pass along with his bodyguard. That won't be enough for him. There's another mage of the Circle here. He confronted us in the mountains. Your messenger was a traitor. He led me right to him. Another Circle mage? <laughs> Ye gods! Who? His face was hidden under a dark hood. And the traitor? Then, the Dark Circle Mage gave him his casket for the leader of the Black Fist. The Black Fist? Impossible! That would mean... To arms! Cave Orcs! They're coming in from the Shadow Pass! Orcs! They must have followed you from the mountains! Quickly! Oh, a battle. We are being attacked by orcs. The Order must participate in the defense. The town laws demand that we intervene. Take over the command of these knights. Oh. At your service, sir! Follow the soldier to the gate. Return to me when the attack has been repulsed. Good luck. Follow me! There they are! That's cool. <laughs> Keep them away from the city. Oh, we got the cool. I'm ready. So the enemies of fear. To adventure. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Moving out. They aren't our troops. They started to patrol again. Wish the orcs were a little bit uh, more numerous. We didn't lose any man. That's good to know. Good job, soldiers. You help defend the city. It was kind of anticlimactic. They weren't as strong as we had. We wanted them to be. All right, let's speak to this guy. Good work, friend. Now. Let us consider what else must be done. Somebody has to follow Rowan and warn him. I, And I think I know who. But first show me the casket you told me of. Here. The Dark Mage gave it to the messenger. It contains plans for an attack. Let me see. Hmm. It is closed with a magic seal. You won't be able to open it without the password. Is there any kind of magic that will break it open? Yes. However, this seal was made by a circle mage, and only a circle mage can break it. Then I must bring the casket to Rowan. Aye. Consider this your first task as a fighter of the Order. Which route will Rowan take? Hmm. He will first go to see Darius, the cartographer in Leonon. Darius has long spoken of a threat beyond the pass. This letter will open the gate to Lianon for you. And this runer here may be just as useful for you. Ask Darius about Rowan's whereabouts. Look for Rowan and warn him. If the Dark Mage finds him first, then may the gods protect us. All right. So I have three options. What is the Black Feast? How do I get to Leonon? And what does the Order of Dawn stand for? Let's ask the second question. How do I get to Leonon? Go to the northeasternmost end of the city. There you will find a gate which is guarded by soldiers from the house of Leonida. Give the soldiers my letter. They will open the gate for you. Behind it you will find the portal to Leonon. Right. What is the Black Fist? What is the Black Fist? The Black Fist is a band of mercenaries and looters under the leadership of a war veteran named Brannigan. Until recently, they were just a gang of robbers. An annoyance, nothing more. But for the past few weeks, disquieting reports about their mischief have reached us. People speak of veritable hosts who have rallied to their banner, equipped with new weapons, armor, and with new commanders. Someone is supporting them. Somebody with money and influence. All right. 
What are these portals? What are these portals? The portals are magical connections between the islands. They are the only way anyone can travel from land to land and cover the huge distances between them. Where do they come from? Rowan made them. We don't know much about them, only that he was gone for six years and that he built them in every land. While he was making them, he didn't distinguish between the nations of the light and the darkness and just as little between nations and creatures. It was his wish for the world to become one again. This is why we need the gate fortresses. All right. What is the house of Leonidar? What is the house of Leonidar? Leonidar is one of the five great royal houses of Nortanda. It once controlled the green lands north of here, all the way to the coast of Fiar. Now they only dominate the island of Leonon and are the smallest of the still existing houses. The other houses are Utram, Hallet, Wolfgar, to whom this city here belongs, and Iskander, which, however, was snuffed out. All right. Um, what does the Order of Dawn stand for? What does the Order of Dawn stand for? The Order stands for the new beginning, the setting out towards a new era. Rowan himself created it to help him organize the new world. We are protectors, teachers, and builders. It is our task to help the new realms. Even the Dark Nations see this as our task. Though there are many in our midst who are striving for more. For fame, for power. But Rowan will not reveal the secrets of his magic. He has witnessed what it is capable of. Nevertheless, conflict and envy arise amongst the brothers of the Order. But don't be misled by that. Concentrate only on your tasks. All right. Let's exit. Greetings, friend. Ah, I can't do any more there. It's done here basically. Should go to the portals. It's an of Greyfell. This is the, the other hairstyle that I uh, almost wanted to use. It looked pretty cool. Opinion. Actually, I liked it more this look than the, than the one I'm using. But uh, I played with this previously, so I just wanted to recreate the same progress after I recorded. I didn't record in the past, so I needed to restart all over. But I wanted to continue my old campaign. Maybe I can do another class later. Now, now I'm a warrior. Maybe I do a mage later or something. Let's speak to this guy, Seno, the dentist. A customer. Welcome. Open wide and show me your teeth. There's certainly something wrong with a few of them. Can't you feel this pulling sensation? You won't make any money on me. My teeth are just fine, thank you. I also puncture cataracts. Your eyes look a little dull to me. No thanks again. Oh well. Sooner or later you'll come crawling to me. Don't wait until it's too late. Otherwise, it will all end with your death. I've already died so many times. What do you mean? Ah, wait. You're a rune warrior, aren't you? You might be able to do me a favor. The last time I was in Leonon, a gang of goblins stole a set of my most expensive pliers and tweezers. Should you happen to find them... I find the idea of goblins pulling one another's teeth out highly interesting, but I will keep an eye out for them. All right, we got a new mission. So there is the cartographer. Show the letter from Satarius to the guard at the portal of Tulianon. Two uh, crassers, pliers. Find the predator goblin and confiscate the pliers. Okay. Need to speak to other characters in the town, I think. If 
before going there. Can't speak to everyone. You're at a gate with a slow air. Closed. You have a uh, hot ceiling. They have the same faces as the playable character can have, but different clothes. Okay. I carrying a like I don't remember the word. Okay. Citizen of Grave. Merchant Finvi. Oh, she's an elf. Yeah, the elves in this mod look kinda good. Okay. Um. Oh, we can uh, buy some stuff here. This, this. Ruined Mentalist, Fair and Level 17. Abilities, heavy combat arts, large blade weapons, stat strength plus 45, stamina 37, agility 34, dexterity 34, intelligence 30, wisdom 30, charisma 30, resistance is fire magic plus 30, ice magic plus 30, black magic plus 30, mind magic plus 30, speed run plus 100%, fight plus 110%, cast plus 100%. This room can be inserted in the room board to be used as mo uh, on monuments later. Yeah, I need to find a room board first. Citizen of Greyfell. Hope there will be options to like attack cities like this and slay every civilian and such. I don't know about that. If you play the evil factions. Alright, you can't do much more here. You've had 
other merchant. They sell different wares. Do not have the money to buy anything from her. This guy don't have any money for it either. And here we have a Centus the Trader. Can't speak to him. Okay. And the merchant Craig Helgerson sells some weapons. Birchwood staffs. Iron dagger. Oh, demand. Ruin for troll workers. And orc workers. That's awesome. We can already get such things. Hmm, <laughs> but they cost a lot um, level 21 and level 17 can't use them yet trolls and orcs I rather have uh, dark elves Let's see what this person will sell she can sell a lot of uh, skills uh, Magic powers, scrolls actually, fire bust level 3, observation, rock bullet, ice burst, ice shield. Okay, so he sells a lot of spells. You aren't the right class for that. Oh, more uh, scrolls, distract, illusion. Okay, a bunch of different scrolls. Here we have a guy. So he will spawn like this. Let's give him an armor. Some pants. Sword. By the way, armor 12, stamina 3. 12, stamina. Ah, uh, this one is better. Let's give him a helmet too. Alright, we're done there. This is our warrior cord. We'll join us whenever we find a monument. More spells. Poison out of weakness. Ice shield, hello, healing, life tap. Don't have much use for that right now. Of weakness, so yeah. Would have been nice to be a mage caster and then be able to summon creatures and such. Okay, but anyway. Wolf. Summons a wolf to support the caster. White magic. That's cool. I like summon skills. We will probably play this game again later, but uh, we'll uh, play as a caster. But for now, we will play the warrior. So, we do not have enough money to buy anything there. Current amount of money you possess. Use the mo this money to buy objects from merchants. 100 copper coins equal 1 silver coin, and 100 silver coins equal 1 gold coin. Alright. Let's move towards the portal. Ah, so these are the Quest log. Find the predator goblin and confiscate the pliers. Show the letter of Satarius to the Grand Guard. Yeah, portal. Where's the portal? There. Just on the other side of that gate. Ah, the guard should be here. There he is. Leonon is a war zone. No one may cross it without a pass. I have a letter from the Order. Let me see it. 
That's fine. We're always glad to see someone from the Order in the land of the Leonidars. Open the gate! All right, they opened. Right away, sir! Let's order our army to follow us. Need them to come over here. There he comes. If they can follow us to the next area. Moving out. Let's move the troops over there first. And the area of the portal soldiers. Just in case. This might be goodbye. Might need to start from scratch here, but I believe we can take a portal back here and then buy from the merchants and such. So everything we have done here will still be available later. So it's like uh, an interconnected world where we can finish a map, move to, ne to the next map, and move back to this map if we want to hire or buy anything from someone, hire uh, heroes or buy anything, and also we can visit the locations, but I don't know if we can take the troops with us. I don't think so. Here's the hurt guy. He also reached this spot. Okay. So, if we check the area from above, we can see that it's pretty big. Supposed to stand uh, at the portal. Yeah, we have the troops. All right, we are done. Sure that you want to enter this portal, yes. So I feared we didn't get the army to follow us here. They are still on the other side. If I go back, just see what happens if we still have the army or not. Oh, the army disappeared. The city is still here, I see. That sucks, we lost the army. Okay. So the armies do not follow us to, to different areas. So this is uh, the end of the first episode. I believe we have played uh, the entire... Uh, wait a second. Infantry. Mean inventory. Um, so we need to kill a goblin. And we need to show the let. We did that. P -p pass through the portal. I believe uh, we could end here the first episode. So let's save the game. So Leonon is the new area. Let's save. Check save games. We can see. Yeah. Um, okay, thanks for watching, see ya.